doing a video of my Mossberg 930 home defense. I have gotten a lot of comments asking about things I've done to it, so I am going to let you know. It started as a home defense, and I, I wanted an SPX, uh, but it cost too much, so I made my own. I got the same stock that's used um, in the SPX as the Chote, and then the uh, same mag extension. Um, the only thing that it doesn't have is the, um, the sights, which I could do without because I have a True Glow Red Dot. That's a GG and G scope mount base, and also have a GG and G, uh, the tactical bolt handle. Um, I have a Aim Pro, the uh, Picatinny four four grip. Um, have the uh, vertical grip, uh, Magpul, um, sling sling. Um, Sling hook. Um, have a Surefire 6P um, and I have all buckshot here and all slugs, slugs, buckshot. I keep three inch triple ot in the in the tube. And then I have another one back here. There's three slugs and another six. And I've got my little, I have a bandolier sling, and this is all holds buckshot. So fully loaded holds 57 shells. People ask me, you know, why don't you get a bandolier, or why do you have so much, so many uh, slugs? I mean, uh, shells mounted to the gun. Well, if I need to grab this gun, and all I have to do is grab this, and I got 57 shells ready for me, they can I can pop them out. You know, it'll be much lighter, but I leave them in there. When at home, when I go to the range, I'll take them out. And because we know that the shells are big and they're having to take up a lot of room. So, you uh, you know, if this is next to my bed. So, I can't just throw on a pair of pants and start loading shells in my pockets if there's an intruder or whatnot. So, it's already ready on the gun and I have the flashlight and the red dot. So, it's good for night and day. And uh, the thing I like about this True Glow is the, uh, the reticles are changed between... It's uh, red and green, and you can change between, oh, come on, focus. Well, let's just turn it on. There's a circle with a dot, and a, a smaller one, and then... A uh, there's a dot, then a smaller dot, and then it goes between red and green. And that's my shotgun. And the next video is going to be on my beloved AR, so check that out too.